In the scorching late afternoon heat of the Jurassic, within a dried Morrison riverbed, two opposing forces prepare for a life or death confrontation. An 80-ton Diplodocus cornered with nowhere to flee, and a swift, coordinated pack of Allosaurus closing in. This is no battle between monsters, but between real animals shaped by evolution, each embodying a distinct survival philosophy. Allosaurus, the two-ton, 30-foot hunter, was a master of agility and precision. Its lightweight yet powerful skull and serrated blade-like teeth enabled the signature hatchet strike, where the predator drove its upper jaw downward to slice flesh open. Its muscular forelimbs, armed with three sharp claws, acted as grappling hooks to anchor onto a giant's hide. In contrast, Diplodocus, stretching over 100 feet, relied on overwhelming mass and its most formidable weapon, a 40-foot tail capable of cracking at supersonic speeds, strong enough to shatter ribs with a single strike. This showdown is born from environmental pressure. During the wet season, lush fern savannas and sprawling rivers fed the enormous appetites of sauropod herds. But when the dry season arrived, vegetation withered, rivers shrank into cracked mud channels, and life clustered around the last water sources. Smaller prey vanished, forcing Allosaurus to target the only resource left. Massive, weakened sauropods funneled into predictable migration corridors. The predators understood this and waited. The battle unfolds as a calculated siege. The Allosaurus pack spreads out, avoiding the deadly perimeter of the sonic boom tail. One darts forward to distract. Another slips beneath the danger zone. A third leaps and digs its claws into the giant's thigh. While Diplodocus struggles to shake it off, the pack leader strikes, carving a deep, bleeding gash. Their strategy is clear, not a killing blow, but attrition, a slow, relentless drain of strength. Diplodocus counters with stamina, bulk, and devastating tail strikes, but the narrow riverbed leaves it little room to escape. Fossil evidence supports this scenario. Sauropod bones bearing deep parallel gouges match Allosaurus teeth precisely, and healed bite marks prove these attacks occurred on living animals that escaped clear proof of active predation, not scavenging. This clash defined the late Jurassic ecosystem, the coordinated, death by a thousand cuts assault of Allosaurus versus the living fortress of Diplodocus, preserved in stone for millions of years.